guys, we are filming an impromptu video because I just got plant mail and I'm so excited. I have not unboxed plants in so long. Oh my gosh, we're doing it. Buckle up. Okay, can't wait. Okay, I'm gonna try to gather myself here. I'm so excited. If you're new to my channel, hey, what's up? My name is Fern. I make videos all about house plants, which obviously excite me very much. So my friends over at Plant Haven Toronto actually reached out to me and asked if I wanted to do another unboxing with them. And of course I said yes. So these plants were kindly gifted to me. I appreciate it so, so much. They are such an awesome company and I'm so stoked whenever I get plants from them. I will link my last unboxing above if you haven't seen that, but all the plants from that unboxing are doing so well and it was a really great experience. So I'm so stoked to see what's inside this box. I have no idea what they have sent me. So let's just crack her open here. There is their cute little thing. I guess I should have had, I, you can't really see it anyways, but. That is their cute little um, logo on there. This, they sent this out yesterday and it showed up today. So that's amazing shipping. Oh my gosh. I'm so curious as to what's in here. So curious. Oh, they wrote me such a sweet note. It sounds like there's some more Hoya in here. The owners of this shop just seem like the sweetest people. Okay. Oh, they're, they're labeled. Perfect. That makes it easy for me. Okay. Oh my gosh, there is a handful of plants in here. Okay, so they're all, whoops, maybe I'll hide the hide the name so it'll be a surprise for you, but they're all nicely packaged in this kind of paper. Okay, first one. Oh my gosh, this is so cool looking. Cutie. Okay, this is what it looks like. And this is Hoya Undulata. Hoya Undulata Green Leaves. Very cool. I love this type of Hoya with these long kind of like wonky looking leaves. So cool. I definitely don't have this one, so I'm so excited to add this to my collection. My Hoya collection is growing like crazy, you guys, and it's so cool because there's so many different species. So yeah, love that. Looks beautiful. Absolutely no damage from shipping whatsoever. It looks perfectly happy. So cute. Okay, gonna set him off to the side. And let's do... Okay, I'm pulling out the next one. Plant Haven Toronto actually has such an amazing selection of Hoya. If you live in Canada and you're looking um, for somewhere to order Hoya, they have so many. And like I said, mine have done absolutely amazing. And I'm not just saying that because they were sent to me. They are actually all thriving. <laughs> This leaf is huge. Whoa, what the heck? This is actually one that I've seen online um, that I've been wanting as well, but I did not know that the leaves got this huge. This is massive. Like seeing this in person, this is as big as my hand. That's a big Hoya leaf. So this is Hoya chicken farm, Hoya species chicken farm and has one massive leaf there and then it has this other leaf down here i have a friend who has one of these and it bloomed recently and the blooms were so cute so love that maybe one day we will get a bloom from her so cool it looks amazing i literally can't believe how big this leaf is it's so nice Oh, I end up making such a mess because I just get so excited. Packaging everywhere. 
Okay. I have never heard of this one before. I am very curious to see it. <gasps> so cute. Oh my gosh. I really like this one. Look at this. It's so pretty. Look at those dark leaves. Oh my gosh. It's so pretty. It's it's more like a thin leaf. Okay, let's see the name. This is Hoya CV Kamuki. Kai Kaimuki? Kai oh my gosh. I might I might be absolutely butchering that, but however you pronounce your name, you are so cute. I have never seen this one before, you guys. So cool. And it looks so healthy. These traveled so well. The moss is still just like lightly moist. Like it feels perfect. I love this one so much. Okay, the next one is one that I have actually been wanting for quite some time, but I still don't own. So I'm so excited about this. I can't wait to see it. This is one that a lot of people have, but I just don't have it in my collection yet. Oh, it looks so nice. It looks so nice. Oh my gosh. It has so many leaves. Look at how many leaves this thing has. This is like a full, full freaking plant. Oh my gosh, so this is Hoya Sunrise, if you can't tell. This leaf really looks Hoya Sunrisey. It's very um, sun-stressed and beautiful. Oh my goodness. I cannot believe how lush this is. This is so nice. Oh, I'm so happy to have this in my collection finally. This looks beautiful. I am really, really excited about this one. I love sun's dressing, so this is just like totally my jam. Honestly, I don't think I've met a Hoya that I don't like though. <laughs> I like them all so much, but yeah, very nice. Very cute, oh my goodness. This package literally made my day, made my week. I've actually been having like a weird couple days as well, so this is a really nice pick me up. Okay, so there's one more Hoya, and then there is something else in the box. So let's open this guy up. I'm actually really curious to see what this one looks like. Because I have another Hoya that was labeled as this, but you guys told me it's something else. So let's see. <gasps> oh my gosh, this is so so cute. Oh my goodness. Look at that little cutie. <gasps> I love this so much. Oh my gosh. This is so nice. So this, <laughs> I keep, I'm just like going on about it and I haven't even told you what it is. This is Hoya Lacunosa Silver and and if you've watched my Hoya collection, then you might know that I have another plant that was labeled as Hoya Lacunosa Silver, but you guys told me it was Croniana. It was a whole big thing. So it'll be interesting to compare these side by side. I think that this does look different than the other one that I have. This one is definitely a lot more lush and this has a lot more silver. Look at how nice that is. Oh, this is so beautiful. I'm so stoked about this. How adorable. These all just look incredible. Okay, I am grabbing the last plant, which is actually not a um, Hoya, but it is one of my favorite plants. And on the letter that they sent me, they wrote that they thought I would like this plant. And y'all are absolutely correct. I love this plant. Oh my gosh, let's do the reveal. cute oh my goodness it is a ripsalis paradoxa which is a more like succulent type plant this is so stinking cute oh my gosh i'm so excited about this 
I actually have a small cutting of this guy. It's actually right behind me, right here. Boop. Which hasn't done anything since I got it. It's just this one little guy chilling. So I can have, you know, a little plant once I add these guys in. That's freaking amazing. I'm obsessed with these, especially when they get longer and start trailing. They are so stinking cool. These are pretty hard to find in Canada as well. So if you've been looking for Ripsiles Paradoxa, Plant Haven Toronto, you guys. Such a cool plant. All right, I have once again been absolutely spoiled. Thank you so much, Plant Haven Toronto. It is always such a joy unboxing packages from you because everything just comes in such fantastic shape and does really well for me. So thank you so much. I hope that you guys enjoyed watching this unboxing. Of course, I will have all of the information for Plant Haven Toronto linked in the description box. I'm always so excited to highlight Canadian plant shops on my channel because there's so many people on YouTube who talk about plant shops in other parts of the world. So it's really nice to point you guys in the direction of some reputable shops here. Let me know which plant was your favorite that I unboxed down below and also any care tips. If you own any of these plants, leave me your care tips down below. I would love to hear from you. Give this video a thumbs up if you like unboxings and I will see you guys in the next one. Okay, bye.